welcome to Queen of T-Shirts. Please share and like and subscribe. If you are not willing to learn, no one can help you. But if you are willing to learn and determined to learn, no one can stop you. We are here today to unleash our creativity. So let's get started. Okay, hello everyone. This is Ruby with uh, Queens of T-shirts. So I'm going to some of you guys come in and then we're gonna go over how to make a cup. So when you come into the live, go ahead and comment and let me see that you're in. Hey, Aunt Liz. My auntie is on here now. Hey, Aunt Liz. <laughs> That's my auntie. Hope all is well, guys. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. So I'm going to get started again. Thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate it. I um, am actually, this is the uh, Austin and Campbell Enterprise LLC doing business as Queen of T-shirts. And yes, we sell T-shirts. We sell cups, anything that I can put writing on or sub on, uh, anything that I can do, I, I am doing it, trying, at least trying. So uh, I do have a Facebook group you can uh, go into, which is uh, Ru Ruby at Queen of T-Shirts, or it's just Queen of T-Shirts. Whatever you want to put in, you can bring me up. Uh, I have an Instagram. It's Queen of T underscore shirts. And then my YouTube channel is Queen of T-Shirts. So I'm trying to do a little everything, guys. But we're going to be working on this 20-ounce cup. I'm going to show you the software I'm using, and I'm going to set up a picture on it. So I have two rooms set up. Uh, this is my working room, and then I have a blue room, which my husband, my husband is in the blue room. So I'm going to be subbing on this cup. I don't want to keep you guys too long, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to share my screen for the picture I'm going to put in, so I'm going to minimize myself and share this screen here. So I am, let me see, there we go. Bring this up a little bit. So this is the picture I'm gonna use. If you have never worked in a silhouette, this software is free for those of you who like to do this or desire to do this. this the, um, uh, I have the business edition and uh, yes, I had to pay for this, but what I'm doing, you don't even need to pay for it. It's absolutely free if you're interested in doing this. Um, let me just bring this over a little bit. So you can go so to silhouetteamerica.com. That's silhouetteamerica.com. Uh, okay. So, how you uh, actually bring in your documents, come on, you're just going to go up to the top and um, you go to your file, wherever your file is located at, uh, you're just going to go ahead and hit merge to bring in your picture, we're just doing it right now. And, or you can drop and drag your picture into this file uh, and just bring it in. So I am uh, using go ahead and my Mac. So if you this. have my a Windows PC, here. it will be a little bit different uh, the size in bringing of the picture in your file. I have so I believe you would go to file the 20 manager into your folders. A nine and a half by 8.1. So once you bring your picture in, it may not come in that size. 
I'm gonna bring this over a little bit and then I'm gonna let's see here I'm gonna bring this up a little bit so you can see okay there we go so I'm gonna put this picture on this cup here uh since it's Halloween I'm going to go ahead and put something on here for Halloween. Now, I did a video before, but my internet was in and out, so I thought I'll come live today. So if you do come in, please go ahead and share. So my picture for this cup, I already measured a cup. It is going to be nine and, nine and a half inches around and then eight inches down but i do a little bit over so i can cover just the edge of this a little bit so once i did that um everything looks great i'm not gonna put anything special no other wording i'm not even putting wording on it i'm gonna go ahead and make sure my printer is set up properly uh i do have a printer right behind me i'm gonna print this off I'm just going to do the page setup on here to make sure everything is set up properly. Um, I have a Sawgrass 500 printer, which I got for my for it wasn't my birthday or Christmas for Christmas. I got it for Christmas. Uh, my kids bought it for me. Love you guys much. And so the paper size I'm going to use for this is an eight and a half by eleven. Um, uh, the paper I'm using is called a sub and it allows me to uh, put the ink on top of this there's a special coating on this which allows me to sub on it meaning put heat on it to penetrate into the cup um, so I'm going to go ahead and update this now I'm just going to go ahead and print this out and then we're going to go into the other room. Um, if it just looks good, sizing is okay from up here, a, uh, nine and a half by 8.1. I'm going to go ahead and hit print. I have several printers, so I'm going to go to the Sawgrass SG500, what is what I'm going to use. And I'm not going to mirror the image because when I go to the Sawgrass tool, it's going to do that. So let me bring up my Sawgrass manager. Okay, it's bringing it up. It looks like it may be behind something. So give me just, there we go. Okay, so I am just going to go ahead and print this out. Everything looks good. Should be coming out shortly. A little bit better. And so I'm going to let this dry. But what I am going to do, I'm going to have to cut around here, around the sides where you see the white part at, to actually put it around the cup. And that's what I'm going to do. So we're going to go in the other room so that I can get this together so we can go ahead and sub on the cup. And like I said, I'm not gonna be long tonight. Um, give me just a second here. I'm gonna put you on a pause right now. Alcohol, I'm gonna use alcohol. Okay, so I'm going to use some alcohol to wipe this down with, and then we're going to get this together to put into this machine here. Uh, the paper towel. I'm going to take the top off because we can't suck with the top on. So I'm taking this off. Okay. 
So you're going to need a sheet of paper to wrap around it. And this is nothing but, but your paper. And you're going to need some tape. And you're going to need, I got, um, this is called pool. I just cut them up <laughs> and put them together so I can put the cup on top of it so I can wrap it with a piece of paper. So I think my paper is ready and I'm just going to cut it down. So my picture is ready and I'm just going to cut around this so I can put it on the cup. Yeah, it's going to be okay. So if you just came in the room, please go ahead and like it. It's a process, guys. I think it's going to be good. Preparing my tape. So I'm going to start from the bottom with the tape, and you have to turn it really tight the paper, really tight. So there's no air that gets in. Okay, it's coming along. I am just putting a lot of tape on it just to make sure no air gets in because it will ghost if you have air that gets in and it won't look right. Okay, so I'm going to get a long piece and put straight down the middle. Still have a little opening. I don't know if you can see it, but I still have a little opening here.
So now I'm going to put the tape straight down the middle where the line is. I don't know if you can see that. Hey, Joy. How you doing? Oh, there we go. Good to see you. You made it. I am subbing on a cup. Oh, you just got off. Oh, thank you, Joy. <laughs> you wouldn't believe what this is, Joy. Uh, uh, thank you. They are beautiful. They are beautiful. Thank you for the heart. Okay, I think this is going to be it. Let me see. <laughs> Janet Jackson. <laughs> I'll listen to you. Okay, so I know, huh? Always me, huh? I'm going to find a way. <laughs> okay. So hopefully everything is okay here. So now I'm just going to put tape around this, around the edges here. And I think I need to use some bigger tape. Let me get this other bigger tape. Larger tape here for a second. I have a girlfriend that does hair that was on here, Miss Kim. She's bad girl. So I'm just putting tape around the edge of this so that um, air doesn't get through it. I know it's a lot to do in trying to make cups, but it's worth it. The beautiful designs that you can do. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is just put tape around here so air doesn't get around there. And then we're going to put it inside the look, oven here. I think I'm good here. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do so that the ink doesn't go through here and get into my machine, I am going to um, 
put this, put your paper over it. And you'll see what I mean. I'll show you in a moment. And it's just going to be just a little bit of tape. That's all. So that's what. A lot of tape. And this is heat tape that I'm using. Okay. So the cup is all set to go. I'm going to put it inside this machine here. Uh, this is actually a tumbler machine, cup machine. And it's going to heat in that ink onto the cup. Give me just a second, guys. So I'm going to cut this on. Let me make sure. Yeah, it's good. So I had it. I did a cut the other day or yesterday that I had to get out. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it on. My temperature is going to be at 350. I have to do this for 90 minutes. Then turn it over on the side that I have the uh, tape on for another 30 minutes. But um, also this t-shirt, as you can see, I can't wait to do the family reunion to do the shirts. But this is my glitter shirt, as you can see. It says Austin and Campbell Enterprise. This is our business, Austin and Campbell Enterprise LLC. And but I'm doing business as Queen of T-shirts. But yes, I just blinked this out yesterday. Yeah, it is nice. I love the bling. And it comes through so good. This is almost ready. So, okay, so it's at 350. I'm going to do it for 90 seconds. And then I'm going to put on heat gloves because I can't handle it without heat gloves. So now I'm going to flip it over for another 30 seconds. I love this machine. But this cup here is insulated and it will keep your hot hot and your cold cold. And this is a 20 ounce cup. Okay, so let's see here. I think I'm going to go to 50. Okay. I'm going to take it out. It's a smoking. You're supposed to let it cool off. I'm going to cut this off. Look how beautiful this is. Love it, love it, love it. What you think? Hey, Lee. <laughs> hey boo oh yes I would love to show you boo we gotta have a one on one but this is the cup what you think turned out really good and all that tape did good Addy mix it <laughs> <laughs> okay, Trees. So, this is what you can do with a heat press. Did I cut it off? Oh, okay, my cup press. You can um, sub some cups. And um, if you're interested in learning how to do t shirts, I can assist you with that as well. Um, but yes, boo, we got to get together, boo. 
uh, do a one-on-one, -on -one, and I can definitely show you. But yes, I um, gleaned this out yesterday. Oops. Out yesterday. <laughs> Come check your niece out. So, guys, I said I wasn't going to stay long. I know everybody else is on a different time than I am. Some of you are on a different time than I am. Um, but, yes, I thank you guys for coming in. Please, please, please uh, go ahead and like my uh, YouTube channel, my Facebook um, channel, my Instagram. I am actually on TikTok, too. Just hadn't uploaded anything, but I am on TikTok as well. And um, if you want to get a cup done, I can personalize a cup for you. I do have some uh, on my website that I can do for you. Uh, just go to queensoftshirts.com uh, and uh, you'll see my inventory that I have available. Now, I do have, this is a 20 ounce cup. I do have a 30 ounce cup as well. I also have the glow in the dark cups. So I could have did this on a glow cup. And then when you actually get in the dark or at night, it will glow through this. It will glow. But this is just a regular cup. The glow in the dark cup, I have a 20 ounce. But yes, I think it turned out really nice. No streaks. Very beautiful. Colors that came in good. And I, I just wanted to use this picture because of the colors. Thank you, church girl, peach crown. <laughs> peach crown inside. Well, trees, you know what? I, I can do that. If that's what you want, I can do that. Thanks for the thumbs up. I can do that if you want. If you want to want me to do that, but I'm sure you're not gonna take it to church. Okay, guys, look, I am going to actually uh, get out of here. Um because I have other things I told my, my granddaughter, she wanted a shirt and she wanted it with the crown with her name on it, with some bling. So I got to show her how to do this, do the bling as well. Um, but Boo, I think that you will love the rhinestones, um, you know, basically for women, I think you would love that. <laughs> Water and wine on first Sunday. Hey, John, how you doing? <coughs> Excuse me. So I was actually just showing everybody what I did. Uh, I just subbed on a cup. Uh, using my tumbler press. And then also... I made this t-shirt yesterday with Austin and Campbell Enterprise, if you can see that. Let me let me kind of turn it around here. Austin and Campbell Enterprise, which is my company's name, but we're doing business as Queen of T-shirts. But I did not want to keep you guys any longer. I appreciate you guys coming in to see what I'm doing. Hopefully tomorrow I can um, help uh, my granddaughter princess in doing her t-shirt. I told her uh, we can do it tomorrow since tomorrow is Friday. We can actually get uh, this done tomorrow and she can come on and show you what she can do. So I, I really need this business for them for the youth so that they can start making extra money. So guys, I am going to end this broadcast. I'm going to sign off. Don't forget to go to my website, Queen of T-Shirts, 
www.thepeopleshow.com. Okay, not a problem. Uh, Queen of T-shirts.com. Who is Facebook user? user? <laughs> I don't know who I'm speaking to, but uh, okay, call me later. You got my number? Just give me a call. But I'm going to end this broadcast. I love you guys. May God bless you. May he keep you. You guys, all of you guys be safe. Thank you so much for stopping by. And don't forget to share and like my page and let other people know what I'm doing. Love you. Have a great one.